Let's do a quick update on the HP Dumpster Xeon workstation. The two new Xeon uh, CPUs are arrived. They are E5345s. They are quad core 2.33 GHz each. In the last vlog I tried to install the X5355s in the system, but the system didn't like the 120 watt CPUs. So I gonna install the 80 watt CPUs now, then boot up Windows and see what the Cinebench score is. CPUs are installed now. I also tested the system with only 120 watt CPU and it gave the same error that the CPU is uh, using too much power. So let's try it now out with the 280 watt CPUs. Yes, the upgrade is successful. We have uh, Two E5 5345s installed at 2.33 GHz and I now have a total of 8 cores in the system. So let's boot into Windows. So here we have it, 8 cores installed and 16 GB of memory. So I went from a, a quad core 1.86 uh, GHz uh, CPU with 2 GB of memory to an 8 core with 16 GB of memory. So that's a pretty nice upgrade. The score with the E5-5320, the quad core 1.86 GHz was 2.07. So let's see what the new score will be. So the new score is 5.19. And it beats the 4 core 8 thread uh, core i7 uh, 2.8 GHz and it's right under the 4 core 8 thread 3.2 GHz i7. So a pretty nice score for a dumpster uh, machine. So there you have it, the maximum CPUs for the HP XW6400 are E5345s. I will end this vlog now, I will do more vlogs about this system in the future, but uh, today I don't have uh, more time to uh, do a longer episode and I want to have it edited and uploaded today. So thanks for watching, please like and share this video, subscribe and leave a comment. See you next time.